We're in the depths of cough and cold season. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Go to any pharmacy or big box store and you're going to find aisles and aisles of products to help you cope. But have you ever considered plant-based medicines to help what ails you? Bryce Wild is an alternative health expert who's here to fill us in on some of the options that might just do the trick for you. Hey, you thanks got for it. being with us. Thanks, Scott, being Kara. With us. Yeah, thanks yeah. so much. I, you know, I'm just getting over being really sick. And I, I talked off camera. Yeah, yeah, and a lot of people on my Facebook page, which I, I, I do like natural alternatives, but I heard so many people talking about the elderberry berry syrup that yes. they were like you have to run and get elderberry syrup but you have brought that as one of your solutions and that's because it works so uh, having authored recently the power of plants i am a huge advocate as often as possible called the natural route so we've got literally my uh, my medicine cabinet here that i brought in studio so you know you may have been thinking reach for the cough syrup right yeah. i mean you've got a cough care so the cough syrup here's how that works it'll suppress your cough mm -hmm. but that's pretty much it not to down on any of these products sometimes we need to do that especially when you're on air you don't want to be coughing all over the place but elderberry this is the power of plants elderberry's got a very potent anthocyanidin that's an antioxidant okay which reduces inflammation which will also help to speed up the recovery of your cough hmm. by about twice so you're going to you're they're going to heal quicker and so the the potent power within the the elderberry and therefore they've made the syrup sambu calls by the way the best studied okay. uh, on the planet there so that's the one you want there, so there you are like different, different the brands you definitely okay. want the sambu call and by the way convenient little gummies and chewables here i didn't know that i was trying to get my kids to drink it they were yeah. a little hesitant yeah. the gummies who knew i'm, I'm gonna have to get the gummies where would i get something like that so this is widely to... available you know cvs walgreens oh, walmart really? yeah yeah i got mine at cvs pharmacy oh, okay. so, so here's the point the power of plants are there you can take both of these things combined if you want to suppress the cough or you need to but to recover quicker. So this is for colds and coughs. This is the season. Don't have to wait till you get one, by the way, either. And that's the cool thing about this syrup. You can take it daily. Oh, seriously? And it helps yeah. keep you from getting sick. You got that's it. That's where I messed up. Bingo. I think I have taken it daily before, and <laughs> yeah. this year I did not. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. <laughs> but okay. So what else we got in there in the, uh, in the medicine cabinet so that I, you might want to reach for? I almost always go for Advil. If yeah. I have a headache, if I'm feeling fever, like anything, I yeah. just feel like Advil works for me. And that's fine. It's an anti-inflammatory, so it'll basically suppress inflammation. But within the power of plants, and you should take this every day, I want to remind folks of the power of the chia seed. Oh, we've heard about the chia seed. You've heard a before. lot about chia. And so you can get that into your shakes and you can put that in your smoothies and on your salad and wonderful. Do it every single day. Reach out of the pantry and remember this. But now they've got chia oil in capsule form. Why? Because it's anti-inflammatory. Inflammation is a medical buzz term of the day for a reason. That's because it underlies all conditions, not just colds and coughs, but, you know, arthritis or irritable bowel syndrome even or cancer. regular bingo, even the big C. So taking it in oil form. Now, I want to I mention this SOW, the sow form here. This is the most sustainable non-GMO form, in my opinion, the best concentrated plant-based omega-3 right now on the market. So okay. that's the one you want to reach for here. How do you take here. it? You literally, it's in capsule form. So like I said, you Once can put the chia seeds. Yep, exactly, bingo. Hmm. Once a day. And yeah. again, CVS or no? Well, you have to uh, it's widely food. available health food stores, health food stores, even online. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Mm -hmm. It's more of a specialized product. Yep. And chia seeds, uh, that's fantastic. But even Chia just, seeds in capsule form. Yeah, yeah. so wonderful. if you don't like it, if you don't want to be all sort of gnarly and put it in your... And you uh, recommend cell. one a day, with it, you, even if you're not sick. Just yeah, keep, you got just, it. The power of plants, should, this is something, thank you for bringing that up, Scott. This is something that you want to incorporate on a daily basis. So reaching toward your kitchen cabinet to fuel your body, to get your body doing what it does best on its own. And in this case, reducing inflammation, we're gonna thwart all kinds of conditions. Because then we turn on our own healing response. Bingo. Okay. You I it. see a Pepto, Pepto Bismol here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, Pepto Bismol, so often you say, where well, it's the stomach flu, right? Uh -huh. Or we have upset stomach this time of the year. Sometimes it's an upper respiratory view, as you've experienced <clears throat> recently, but sometimes it sort of festers in the stomach, right? Mm -hmm. So, nothing wrong with taking some Pepto Bismol uh, or some anti diarrheal, what that, like a modium. What that'll do is, is reduce spasmodic or the over contraction in your gut but what we should be doing every day to support that regardless mm -hmm. of whether we have a cough cold or a stomach flu is soluble fiber yeah, so a quick little demonstration huge. now the power of plants here this is the guar bean guar I was guar? in India and I did a whole research on this so this is an incredible plant the guar bean G -U -A -R? is fractured you got it okay this is tasteless odorless it mixes into anything you can go ahead and try that if you like this is a soluble fiber, which is a prebiotic. Now, 80% of your immune system is enraveled within your gut. Tastes like water. Tastes, Tastes like water, water right? Okay. I would share with you, you but I've been sick. Yeah, no. So 80% <laughs> of your immune system is in your gut. You want to support that. And we've heard of probiotics before. Yes. And that's absolutely key. Probiotics are key, so keep taking them. But that stuff there, soluble fiber from guar bean, 
is going to help manage the uh, probiotics. It's a prebiotic. So literally, it's like fuel for them to survive. It's their food. It's like, okay. uh, you know, uh, fertilizer to soil, so mm -hmm. to speak, okay? So getting that in your system on the daily, soluble fiber, mix it into water, it totally disappears. We only have about 30 seconds, yeah. but for more, we can, everything is in the book. Everything's in the book. Uh, you know, the power of plants is incredible. This is online, Amazon, and, you know, your local bookstores. But just reach up, this is the message, reach more often as you can into your your kitchen cabinet versus just into the medicine cabinet. medicine cabinet to suppress symptoms. Let's get fire up our bodies and get our bodies working better. I'm mm -hmm. excited about this, yeah. this uh, chia, chia seed powder. Chia seed Food powder. as medicine. All right, so if you want to learn more, keep your family healthy. For more information on plant-based medicine, Bryce's book, The Power of Plants, uh, and you can also do a free wellness check, you can head to Bryce's website. It's wild, that's W-Y-L-D-E, onhealth.com.